Bradley. Hello, Grandad. Oh, got the kitchen sink and all, have you? Oh, oh. I'll take that off you. Oh, get in there. Isn't it? Hello. <laughs> you must be Bradley. <laughs> You're a bit early. Oh, sorry, Mrs. Branning. It's really nice of you to have me. <laughs> oh, the place is all ours. <laughs> I've just polished that. Oh, sorry. That uh, is to go in your room. Oh, cool. I really like quaint old things. Oh, charming. Uh, would you like a cup of tea? Oh, please, I'm gasping. Oh, here, Mrs. Branning. <laughs> Mum made me bring some soy milk. Oh. I'm what they call a mild dairy intolerant. Oh, I say. <laughs> How is your mother? Yeah, she's fine, thanks. Says hello. You don't often look like your father, you. Have you heard from him? No. Uh, no surprises there, then. Long time since I swung one of these, I'll tell you. Hand me down some Richard. The guy we've got with a new job. Oh, yeah, what? You do a bit of caddying, do you? Saturday job. The golden rule of caddying is um, show up, keep up, and shut up. <laughs> they always said it was the shutting up I had most trouble with. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, look, we got a little present for you. Oh. Parental advisory. <laughs> yeah, that's suitable for family listening, isn't it? Not exactly. But thanks a million. <laughs> oh, and this is for you. It's called a Dorothy, apparently. Oh, I say, look, Jim. He's brought us a little Dorothy. That's all we need, eh? I don't know what to say. You don't have to say anything, Mrs Branning. <laughs> it's lovely having him with us, isn't it, Jim? Well, go on, then. Go and put the kettle on. <laughs> 